Good day viewers, you are welcome. How to solve this nice functional equations? Given that f of x plus 1 equals f of x plus 3 plus 1. And what is f of x? Before solving this problem, you can just pause this video and give it a try. And let's start solving this. We will consider the solutions. With this question given here, the f of x plus 1 equals f of x plus 3 plus 1. By doing the rearrangement, we are going to make f of x plus 3 to be here as we have f of x plus 3 equals f of x plus 1 minus 1. Let's change the variable here. Suppose I let x plus 3 here, or let me take it from the lowest one, which is x plus 1. If I let u to be equals x plus 1. So it shows that for every x plus 3, we are going to have it as u plus 2. So this is just like by adding 2 to u and uh, x plus 1. So we get x plus 3 equals u plus 2. So changing everything to u, we there have f of instead of x plus 3 we have it as u plus 2 equals instead of x plus 1 we have it as f of u then minus 1 so next let's try and uh, look for this u so this u is always odd for all uh, u in the domain of f a function f and let's try to look for a pattern here we have u plus 2 equals u f of u minus 1 we want to show that for every f when it decreases then the argument increase by 2 and how do you know that suppose we consider this as an argument which always increase by 2 so as far as this keep decreasing let's say i increase this one by 2 we are going to have f of u plus 4 will be equals f of u plus 2 minus 1 but i want to leave this also in terms of f of u therefore this becomes f of u is now f of u minus 1 and we have it as f of u minus 1 minus 1 that is we have f of u minus 2 for every f of u plus 4 it gives us f of u minus 2 and the first one f of u plus 2 it gives us f of u minus 1 but we cannot conclude yet so let's test for another one. Suppose I also increase this one by 2. We are going to have f of u plus 6. This will be equals f of u plus 4 minus 1. But f of u plus 4 is also given as f of u minus 2. Therefore, we draw a conclusion here as f of u minus 3. We are going to see some pattern here showing that f decreases and uh, the argument always increase by 2. So, we cannot make a general conclusion since every number here we are increasing is 2, 2. You can just assume it to be f of u plus 2n equals f of u minus n. We can also test for f of u plus 8. And to see that the pattern still continues so 
this implies that for every f of u plus 2n, this equals f of u minus n, where n is a member of positive integer. Then, let's assume that if you have a general function of f of x, consider this as a linear function. We are going to have, since the increment is 1, 1, then we are going to be having f of x equals, assuming ax plus b, which shows the linearity. Then we are going to input f of u plus 2 equals a into bracket of u plus 2 plus b. As this equals a u plus b plus 2a. But this equals what we have from the above, the initial function which is f of u plus 2 equals f of u minus 1. So by equating these together, or you can just try and test for that as well. So we still get the same thing. So just say we have a u plus b plus 2a equals a u plus b minus 1. So this is what we are going to have. So a u cancelled a u and uh, b cancelled b. When these two negate each other, we are going to have 2a equals minus 1, which draws the conclusions as a equals minus 1 divided by 2. And when we substitute this thing back, we are going to have f of x equals minus 1 over 2x plus b. b a is an arbitrary constant. And we just leave it like that. But if you want to verify if this equation truly satisfies, like the left hand side and the right hand side are equal, what we just do is for the first one, which is f of x plus 1, we are going to substitute it here and we have minus 1 over 2 into bracket of x plus 1 plus b. And also we have f of x plus 3, so which also equals minus 1 over 2 into bracket of x plus 3 plus b. And when we equate this together, they will cancel and we only have 1. So thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, share this video and see you in the next class. Never stop learning. Bye bye.